engineer four in this video you will talk about lesson five how fish breathe all of you know that a human can breathe and survive on land but not under the water but fish can breathe and survive under the water but not on the land how can the fish breathe you have to know that Fish can breathe and survive under the water. How come junior four? Fish have something called gills. Called gills. It uh, this gill, this gills help the fish to breathe. Okay. So you have to know that in the human, we uh, all of us have lungs to breathe. Okay. But fish have gills, so you have to know, fish have gills to breathe instead of the lungs in the human. Okay? The same work of uh, um, gills have the same work or the same function of the lungs in the human. You have to know that gills <clears throat> are found on the side of fish head under Something called pony flaps. Look at this picture. You have to know that gills are found on the side of head of the fish, okay, under something called pony flaps. And you have to know that pony flaps have the ability to open and close. Have the ability to open and close. To open and close. You have to know that when the water enters the mouth of the fish, it can pass. Okay, inside, through, or across the gills of the fish. Then the blood vessels in the gills carry this oxygen to the rest of all body parts of the fish. When the, wa when the water, when the water enters the mouth of fish, it passes, okay, across the gills. Then the blood vessels inside the gills will carry the oxygen gas to the rest of the body. You have to know that fish use gills to take oxygen gas out of water and release carbon dioxide gas. Release carbon dioxide gas. Take oxygen from the water and push carbon dioxide gas. Okay? Now we will talk about a new part which is ecosystem changes are caused by two things. By the nature or by the human activity by the nature or by the human activity some of ecosystem changes are caused by the nature okay like change in the temperature what is the meaning of the nature okay without the human without the human okay the first one change in temperature the amount of rainfall from seasons Number three, severe, severe weather events. Like, what is the meaning of severe? It means difficult. It means very difficult, like the winds. Number four, wildfires and floods. It has what happened, okay, when the amount of rainfall increased more. So, the floods will happen, okay? And when the temperature will be very, very, very high, it will happen wildfires. Wildfires will happen. So you have to know all of this because of the nature, because of the nature. Now I will talk about the some ecosystem change caused by the human activity. Okay? And you have to know this. all these habits, they are very harmful to the environment or to the ecosystem. Okay, junior four. The first one, cutting down the forest. Cutting down all forests. Okay? Or removing all trees. It's a very, it's very harmful for the environment. Okay? Blowing grassland. What is the meaning of blowing the grassland? Don't care about the soil. So the soil will be poor. Okay? The soil will be poor. Don't give us the crops. So it means, so it is the meaning of blowing the grassland. 
Number three, introducing plants and the animals that were never part of the ecosystem. Okay? Introduce plants and the animals were never part of this ecosystem. Okay? So they will die. Okay? Number four and five and six, they are very important. The exhaust from cars and some factors, okay, this black matter, okay, it will cause air pollution. It will cause air pollution. And bad habits like throwing the waste material in the waterway. So it will cause water solution. And when they water the soil with polluted water, so it will be soil pollution. Soil pollution. So we have three types of pollution, which are air, water, and soil. Air solution, uh, air, uh, air pollution, caused by the exhaust from cars and some factors like um, like the very bad smell and black. Okay, bad habits. Like throwing waste materials in waterway will cause water pollution. When they water the soil with the water or with the polluted water, it will cause soil, pollu uh, soil pollution also. Okay, Junior 4. You have to know that plants and animals or the human also affected by the change in the ecosystem. Okay? You have to know that some animals and the plants, okay, try to survive, try to survive and stay alive. So some animals can survive by moving to another ecosystem to find what they need, okay? They can't find, in the, they can't find what they need in this ecosystem. So they have to move from this ecosystem to another ecosystem, okay? Number two, plants. Plants don't move, can't move. So they depend on their seeds. What is the meaning of seeds? Seeds is the, it's the smallest part of the plant. So they depend on the seeds to land in a better place, to land in a better place, to survive and grow, to survive and grow. <coughs> and after that, the human also are affected by the changes in the ecosystem because earth solution makes the human hard to breathe. And you have to know that high level of air pollution, okay, over a long period of time, for a long time, okay, can damage the two lungs and cause heart problems, okay? So, when air, air pollution makes the human heart to please, but when exposing to high levels of air pollution over a long period of time, it will damage the two lungs and cause heart problems. Number two, water pollution makes the human hard to find clean drinking water, okay? The human needs the water to drink, to cook the food. So the water pollution makes the human hard to find clean drinking water. Number three, air, water, and soil pollution make the crops can't grow. Make the crops can't grow. The role of human to help restore the ecosystem. How can the human um, help the ecosystem or improve the ecosystem? How can? The first one, he has to replanting the cleared forest. Replanting the cleared forest. Number two, removing the pollutants of air and water. Search for the reason which cause the pollution for air and water and soil. And he has to fix it. Okay, improve it. Number three, preserving plants and the animals in this ecosystem. Try to protect the plants and animals. Okay, Junior Four. Okay. 